Hello, and welcome back to my Final Fantasy XII Let's Play. We're going to continue right where we left off. We're finishing up this upper side, then we're going to jump down to here. Then we'll go to the center, and we're going to have to zone into that new area, which I obviously know what it is. Then we'll come back across and exit. So let's continue and see, uh, see if we have any other exciting uh, stuff to grab before we move on. That was not exciting. Now, there's no doubt that at some point something will break this chain, but it's fine. So we're getting lots, we're getting copies of stuff at that point. Did I already do that out there? I think I just did, right? Yeah, I know the Mandragoras will break our chain out here, so... Yeah. Oh, maybe not. Reflect. Okay, very cool. And I managed to hit a trap. Awesome. Okay. So Reflect obviously is a spell, and it does exactly what it sounds like it does, which we've actually already covered. I really just, one one quality of life that I do kind of wish that they added was um, the fact that the Caps 99 uh, does somewhat limit you, because... If you really want to sell stuff and get the most for your money, then you have to leave and go back. Uh oh, that's going to break the chain for sure. Oh well, see you later, chain. Oh, that's great. Okay, I got a Yensen scale. Good. I was trying to steal for that. Okay, we did this side here. I know that that used to be used for something. See, I'm still, like, in my mind, I'm pre-programmed for what you used to have to farm back in the original version um, so that you could make the stuff at the bazaars. But with the, the trial mode was, again, I don't think I had said this earlier either, but the trial mode was introduced so that by the time you got all that amazing new cool loot... You had something to fight with it, um, but in, in addition to that, they made they eventually made it to where whatever you steal, you can actually keep, and now you can just steal the weapons that you used to have to craft. So it's um, it's not quite as important to use the bizarre mechanic anymore, except for one or two, you know, a couple of things like those monographs or whatever they're called. Um, let's go back up north and see if we can knock this part out. Of course. I don't even need to use this really, but whatever. I stole a handkerchief. Nice. 198 gallons. All right, so I think this is an area where I can stand here and wait for a set amount of time. Oh, here it is right there, perfect. Now, whole arms can actually hit flying, and so can Vossler. Ooh, Lennon Curse. Let's see if that's any good. It is. Wow, that's a lot. That Well, I say a lot better. It is definitely better. I wouldn't say it's a lot better, but it is definitely better. Okay, great. That was worth it. Another free item. Hmm. 
Another free trap, double traps for us. Again, without, uh... I honestly have no idea why I don't have... You know what? You know what, dude? Okay, bam. Now, I... Now you see the icon there. I should have just done that from the beginning. That slight amount of HP boost is probably not worth it anyway. So at least now we can see the traps. Okay. Let's continue, shall we? Yes! Okay, so we're going this way. I'm sorry, the little mini-map is so dang small that it's hard for me to, to... to know where I'm headed sometimes. So we're going down here first. I don't think there's anything else. Oh, yeah, there is. Wow, a potion. Awesome. Okay. So this is the zone we, we technically don't know where it goes. I mean, again, I do, but here's the introduction to it. Okay, now, I'm pretty sure these guys are going to be way more powerful than what we can handle. So we'll probably have to run. <clears throat> oh, that's not bad. 17? We can probably handle that. If we had our black mage, this would be a lot easier. So the only reason why I'm pushing this right now, well, you can see that the XP is pretty dang good, right? Um, this cavern is actually rather large, and you can push rocks in here uh, that will, like, block paths, or, like, or, I'm sorry, unlock paths, basically. Oh, okay. High potion. Yeah, see that over there? See that rock right there? So if I push that in there, it'll fill that sand trap up, and then I can cross it, right? But if I don't do it... Okay, that guy's level 36, so that's a little too much, I think. So I just wanted to come in and see if I could do that in this entrance. Um, I don't think that's the case, but let me just let me just check. Yeah, this one's blocked already, so there's nothing I can do here. Okay, well... Right now, there's nothing we can do on this side, but we do have this part unlocked, or at least visible, let me put it that way. We'll try this. The, the other entrance is the same place, but a different side, so... I just love fighting in this game. I mean, I know some people are like, oh, the, you know, the, uh, the, the gambits do everything, but to be quite honest with you, if you do the trials, which are the real, I guess that's the real end game to this game. Um, if you do that, you cannot go through that whole thing and just use the exact same, uh, the same gambit system. Like, you have to change stuff up. And sometimes you just do stuff manually, too, so. I love this game. It really is awesome. It's 2022, and I'm still playing it, and it came out in 2006. <clears throat> I mean, granted, it's a, it's like, it's a little bit redone and things like that, but still. Yeah, Fran's damage, obviously, is has gone up for sure. Okay, great. So we've made it all through that. 
We'll come through here, go th back through the middle. We'll have to unlock that side of it, and then we'll we'll shoot across. So that's great. This should be an easy, just one. Yeah, there are a lot of these guys. At some point, we'll need to sell some supplies that we're uh, we've got too much of, because otherwise, it's just a waste. It just goes nowhere. Okay, I just want to make sure I'm going the right direction. I don't think we've been in here, right? No, we have not. Okay. Oh, no. That's another one of those things. Again, if that aggro is, we've got to run for our lives. I'm just going to come all the way down here so there's no chance that we'll mess up. The succulent fruit sells for a decent amount. So it's worth, you know, it's worth grabbing. I like steals of that. <laughs> Handkerchief, I don't care that much about, but it has its purpose. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure that removes oil, so. Okay, how are we looking on, uh... Okay, so everybody in this group is 16. Let's just look at status here. So 36, 22, 22, and then they're 11, 43, 23. Okay. I really do like for all my characters to, to level up at the same time. I know it's dumb. See, she's really dangerously close to that thing. See that? You see how close that could have been? Not wise, Fran, not wise. Okay. I'm telling you, guns, man. When I first played this game, I thought just because of the damage that I saw on the sheet, I thought, oh man, that must suck. But no, that is not at all how that works. Oh my god, there's an, is that the same one that I just ran from? Can't be, right? now. Perfect. Perfect. Let's kill this guy. Come here, buddy. A little samurai like me. Lightning Fang is another like AOE ability, like a spell. It's like a, it's an item, but it's, it's like a one use spell basically. If memory serves. Okay, let's see if this is anything. Round shield. Okay, great. When I, when I get Ash with the sword, that'll be good. All right, let's uh, let's see if there's anything that we can do in here to move rocks. I don't know if you can from this side, but I definitely want to check just to be sure. And that guy is level 17. Oh, that's that's annoying. Dang. 
These guys are tough. Compared to what we're used to fighting, anyways. Fran has basically no MP, so that's... <clears throat> not great. This might end up not being worth them trying to get through here. If you're wondering where we are, that's where we're at relative to the uh, other spot. <clears throat> and there's another spot you can come in that's uh, in the the wester over in Dalmasca, the west side, I'm pretty sure. I think these guys were put here specifically so if you come in at too low of a level, though, you, you know, it's likely you won't be able to make it very far. Okay, well, we can handle this. It takes forever for the Q system. The Q is the only thing that balances it, because without it, man... <laughs> Sight and seeing, that is a... Um... I just want to say it's like trait things. What is it called? What am I trying to say? I um, can't think of the name of it. Um, a technique, that's it. Yeah, sight and seeing, there it is. So I don't see a boulder over here, but okay, cool. I can only imagine it's about to get bad for us. Stagitarius Jim, that was a that was a rare steal there. That I do know. Another one. Wow, that's that's pretty that's pretty awesome considering we don't have thief cubs on or anything. wake this guy up. He's sleeping on the job. Okay, this is going to be real hard not to trip. Wow, it let me go this far. Huh. The only way I know to do this is to try to run into the wall to get past it. Okay, so now we know that that's where this connects. This might be bad for us. High ether. Okay. Um, that makes me worried. Oh, it's only level 14. We should be fine. Teleport's turn. Nice. I can't steal anything now. Ooh, this might this might get a little nasty here. All right, if you're wondering, that platform out there is actually going to be a battle for later. I don't want to give too much away, but if that triggers right now, we are in serious trouble. Like seriously, there's no way we'll we'll survive if it triggers. Turtle shell choker. Okay, I'm, I know that has a specific use. Yeah, 
Yeah, enables casting of magics with a gill rather than MP. Now that probably sounds like it's that's absolutely stupid, but when we get the item item or items I should say that we need to farm gill, <laughs> that can actually be really good. And we'll have hundreds of millions of gill by the end game. So using that would be fine. Okay, that I'm telling you, that gun, <laughs> ignoring defense, is so big. All right, well, at least we know that this connects there, so that's cool. Now, I am most certainly not going to fight everything all the way back. That's too much even for me, so... Well, that's not great for us, but okay. We're going to attempt to just run back. Okay, perfect. Perfect again. Awesome. Amazing. At least we can see the traps. Okay, and now we're going to try to recover. And that's the that's the danger in uh, essentially trying to run through it. Yeah, there's no way she's going to be able to cure us all, so... A little dangerous to just keep going, I guess, but... Eh. I like to live on the edge. So we got to check out what's down here, if there's anything good. Oh, we are dead. have to go to the nearest zone. I got no choice. We're dead. I know for a fact that will murder us, so... And we were already in trouble. Okay, great. Now, let's try this again, shall we? All I know is, at this current level, if you see one of those aggro, get out. Because you don't stand a chance with the current level of magic you have. And yet, there, you really can't... I mean, I guess, late, like, in-game, you can... Oh, you can... You can brute force them, but um, right now they're designed where you need to have magic to kill them. And you need to have a mid-tier amount of magic to do it, so. Okay, now I have no idea where this thing went, so hopefully we don't re-aggro it, because that would be inconvenient. another teleport stone. Okay, so you can get teleport stones just kind of all over. Nothing reliable, but we should have a decent number of them now. <laughs> Alright, well, nothing super great. But at least we check that we were able to check it out, so that's cool. I'm paranoid that thing's going to show back up, so... I'm just gonna go to the right here. Yeah. <laughs> That's the third tier right there in the chain. One gill. Awesome, man. Thank you for that. Okay, so 
in this area now, I don't know if we've killed enough, but I do happen to know there's a rare that can spawn out here. It's this type of mob. If you kill a hundred of these guys, so he spawns right in the center platform. So far, it doesn't look like he's here, so we're good. Because that would be a tough battle, more than likely. <sighs> really? Are you serious? Okay, well that's inconvenient, to say the least. I mean, I could have this automatically applied since it seems to happen regularly right now. Okay, well, the guy didn't spawn, and that's fine. We're good there. We weren't, we're good. Well, actually, you know what? Maybe he spawns up top. I don't remember. I really do hate when he changes targets like that. I mean, why? Why would you not just kill the thing that's right in front of you? That's cool, though. I mean, it is what it is, I guess, but... I'm gonna do a quick save just so that we can refresh our MP. Where'd that guy go? Okay, sounds good. Alright. So technically we're on the second map now, so now we're going to explore all this, essentially in the next episode. That down there is another entrance to the caverns there. Um, and we will start, I think we'll start here in the next episode. So, I do hope you enjoyed the episode. We will see you in the next one. Have a great day.